This is the worst Wiener Schnitzel menu item. And this is the best Wiener Schnitzel menu item. So we're gonna try the worst rated item first, and it's called the Deluxe Dog. Let's try it. If this is the worst one, kind of excited to see what the best one has to offer. Yeah, it's not that bad. This isn't that bad. Would you rate that out of 10? We'll start off with a five. I'm gonna go with a five as well. Don't worry, we are trying the entire Wiener Schnitzel menu item, so you guys don't have to try everything, and we'll let you guys know which item is the best. Now we are trying the number one rated item on on the menu, the chili cheese dog. They definitely just put an American cheese, cheese inside, strip. right? Yeah. And melted it. I like the worst item better. Really? This does taste a little bit more processed. I'm giving you guys a chance to win $300 today. You're gonna guess which are the two highest rated items, and I'm gonna guess which are the two highest rated items, and who's ever the closest win $300. Ooh, okay, I'm locking in. These are my two items. These are my two items. Mitchell, which one do you want to dive into first? This tomato dog. Tomato dog. Take yeah, it I out I saw early, that tomato you know? dog. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> I really don't like that one. This has to be the worst thing we're gonna eat today. A one. I'm gonna have to go with the classic chili cheese fries. Woo! Wiener Schnitzel was actually founded in 1961. Did you know that? Mm -hmm. It's founded in, no you did not. <laughs> <laughs> it ain't no homemade chili, mm. but. It kind of feels like processed. Yeah, it tastes very processed. What'd you rate that out of 10? I'll give that one an 8.5. I'm gonna give that one a solid nine. Shoot. So actually I'm gonna give it 8.5 to keep it simple. Oh, crazy fries. Bacon ranch chili cheese fries. I do not like ranch, so Mitchell, you're gonna have to solo this one. Do not go too crazy. Their uber famous secret recipe is their chili that makes their fries, mm. hot dogs, and burgers fire. The chili is their secret ingredient in everything. I think the chili has been mid so far. Agreed, it's kind of scary that it's secret. Like, what are they hiding from us? But I would say this one is slightly better. Better, so you're giving that what? I'll give it a nine. Oh. If you don't like ranch, Keep it simple with the regular chili. But cheese. that's better. If you like ranch, that bumps it up. Mm -hmm. Woo wee! And a little bacon crunch. Come on now. I'm gonna choose some jalapeno poppers. Ooh. They're crispy, they're crunchy, they got jalapeno and then pop. Oh, they did a real good job. Yeah, spicy. Careful. These are so good. Mitchell and I are lactose intolerant, but. Dude, I wish I could eat jalapeno oh, poppers. Dude, these are so good, right? Is this these too are spicy really good. for you? Spicy. It hurts. Yeah. <laughs> What are you rating that out of flavor out of 10? This is tough. Nine. I'm also going to give that a nine. I was not expecting that to be that good. What the heck is that? It's mini corn dogs. Oh, we are Isn't rocking that sick? with them. Dude, I love the idea of mini things because I got no, a these big... these are huge, honestly. <laughs> these are the regular corn dogs? We got average size corn dogs. <laughs> Do you, do you need, oh. oh my god! The strongest <laughs> and biggest corn dogs I've ever seen. I feel like I've had these before. These taste like microwave corn dogs, but they have a little bit crispier texture. It's mm -hmm. nice. I give that a nine. I also give that a nine. Yeah. <laughs> this thing is better than the chili cheese. We got a three-way tie for first place right now. I'm gonna go Woo! for the chili cheese hamburger. I had zero clue they did this. I know, right? Cross section. We got a single because we didn't want to go too crazy. They also sell this in the double. I don't like that. I feel like if Wiener Schnitzel paid a little extra money to make their ingredients better. They'd be fire. They gotta figure out their chili too. Like <laughs> their secret chili sauce. Maybe make it a little bit thicker chili because this looks like barbecue sauce. Yeah, facts. This one's the one of the second worst. The veggie hot dog was the worst. You know what? Let's try that Reese's shake. You try the Reese's shake. I'll try the other shake as we're going. Cheers. It's thick, but not thick somehow. A lot of chunks. You could tell that, I don't know, is there Reese's no, in yeah, there? Yeah, there were a lot. Of, yeah, I got yeah. straight like Reese's. I got a lot of Oreos in here. Is it, imagine if you dip Oreo into your milk, but you let it dissolve too much. Mm. And it gets really soggy as at the bottom. I might have to give that a 10. We're giving milkshakes at Wiener Sisso a solid 10. If you're craving a Wiener, I mean, you're craving milkshake, um, come to Wiener Sisso. Chicago dog, Mitchell, take a look at this. There's pepper, a pickle, tomato. I've been to onions. Chicago once. I ain't never seen someone look like this. Why is this a Chicago dog? Oh my God, bro, I might throw up eating this. Good luck, see you in the next life. You wanna just skip this one? Yeah. I'll buy, I'll buy it for us. I'll give that like a seven. <laughs> what? That's a one. I tasted all of it. I'm gonna give that a three. Just cause I don't like it. The next thing I'm gonna try is this enormous, mega, oversized uh, corn dog. I've never seen a corn dog uh -uh. this big. Uh uh, that's crazy. This is ridiculous. You want the tip or the end? 
This is worse than the average size corn dogs. But I prefer average, you know what I mean? Mm hmm Because yeah. size, honestly, size doesn't, doesn't matter. matter. Right? Yeah, not at all. Too big makes it hard to cook. Makes it hard to put in your mouth. Mm -hmm. Whoa, I don't know about that. I could probably put anything in my mouth. I actually don't mind that. I'm gonna give that still an eight. What are you giving that? You can I'm gonna give, give it, it a seven. Seven, so that's 7.5. Doesn't make the top two tier list, so it don't matter anyways. Do you want a drink now, or do you want a beer? Oh yeah, let's get some Bev. I actually like cucumber flavored drinks. Cause they're like hella like refreshing. It tastes like a high C. You know how like lemonade kind of burns when you drink it? Mm -hmm. This one doesn't burn. Doesn't burn. Yeah, that's what a high C does. Mm -hmm. High C tastes like smooth. For me it's a nine cause it yeah. still has that kind of painful lemonade drink. I'm gonna put it at 8.5 for us. Regular burger. How hard is it to make a good burger? Like McDonald's got it down, right? Yeah, they McDonald's got it down is a fire well. cheeseburger. Dude, this looks so bad. Yeah, this one does not look right. It's got like a, a smell of a McDonald's burger. With it does a, smell like with, McDonald's. With yeah. like a hint of like fart. That was horrible. I'm gonna give that like a five or six. I didn't mind it, but it's not making it anywhere on the top tier list. Mm -hmm. Our last hot dog, the junkyard dog. Hey. It looks really good. It looks like a chili cheese dog. Yeah, this one looks like the most legit hot dog. The hot dog looks fat. Mm -hmm. It's big, way above normal. Mm. Not bad. I'm one of the better ones. Mm -hmm. Put less chili on there. I think that's smart with the mild amount of chili. Give that a 8p9. All right. I'm gonna give that a seven. Rounds it up to about eight point something. You guys are better at math than I am. Three-way tie between these three items. The shake is still at 10. We still got Sunday. All right. The Sunday's a little melted, but it looks like they got banana, strawberry, vanilla ice cream, and some type of strawberry syrup. Oh. Not it? It seemed like a fake stra- Oh, it's probably like strawberry puree type thing. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. You don't like it? Mm -hmm. What are you rating that? Give it a six. Yeah, I gotta give that eight because I'm thinking like, it can't be that bad. We currently have a three-way tie between the chili cheese, the chili cheese ranch fries, the jalapeno poppers, the huge corn dogs, mm -hmm. but the shake is already winning. Yeah, the shake takes it for the drinks. I'm gonna have to give my vote to the big corn dogs. I am gonna have to give it to the jalapeno poppers. So mm. now we still got a tie. Lynn, we have a tiebreaker. You already tried the corn dog? Yeah. But the jalapeno popper. Yeah, I like the popper. We got a third opinion. We are gonna give Second place to the jalapeno popper. First is the Shake Shack. Let's see who won. I think I put the chili cheese dog mm -hmm. and that shake. I also put the shake and the chili cheese fries. Ooh. So the winner is a close battle. It's a close battle, and it will be determined by rock, paper, scissors. Rock, paper, scissors. Thank you guys for watching. I won $300. Until next time, you guys. Peace. Woo!